Good morning. Mr. Burnham from the church. Mrs. Gloria Ford, how are you today? You're either interested or not interested, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm very sorry, but my sister just called and she's waiting for me oh. right now. I'm very sorry. Okay. okay. All righty. Okay, thank you. Could you see where this would be helpful to you, Mrs. No, it's Grossi. beautiful. I mean, yeah. you can afford it. Oh, dear, 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 dear. This, you're going to be amazed when I tell you. <laughs> no, you see, like anything else, uh, to afford something like this, as I say, it's not like buying a new car, you know? I get it. I place this in home where it's been 18 and 19. So you know what Gloucester is, Mass, the fisherman at sea? Place with one woman with 18 children. And believe you me, as I say, it wasn't easy. But in this life, if you have a desire for anything, you'll get it. Isn't that true? Yeah, Where there's a will, there's a way. That's what uh, that's what Charlie Gipper says, you know. <laughs> you probably heard of him. Notre Dame, the Gipper? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, sometimes. <laughs> you can. Well, let me put it this way. Uh, there are a lot of folks in this world that spend thousands of dollars on material things. But what I mean is this. <laughs> Do you love it? Eh? Do you love it? See, I have one here. It's not as good as this one. It's a bad No, that's all right. You but, know, I mean, do you think you'd appreciate that, Mrs. Crosby? I appreciate when you see that I yeah. don't see you used How to buy now you? because so you're I can the afford winner, it. Right? You think but it? I never heard the... Yeah, well, then, I mean, as I said before, I could ask you one thing as this. Do you think the dollar a day would really hurt you? I wouldn't want to place it if you couldn't afford it. It sure would. You can't, you can't buy that now. Right? You can't so afford you that dollar. Right huh? You can't afford just, that you know, dollar. You some work in the house and down yeah, we're yeah, up to here. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're all up to here. I'm over here. Well, yeah, 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 I don't get any relief, but I don't believe. <laughs> You can wait on it, See, yeah. I don't believe yeah. in getting something that you, you yeah. know. Well, the only thing I can say... I'm sorry that you make the trip and everything, no, but no, I really dear. No, didn't know what yeah. it's all about. That's you tell me my it's name and I give it to you. To you. Yeah. Like my visions. Huh? See? Like my visions. I sell vacuum cleaner. With oh, you do? Now. You sell vacuum mm -hmm. cleaners? You scoop them up, huh? Yeah. Yeah, well, that's all right. So, uh, we scoop them up, too. Well, you're a salesman, you know. You know, I had a vacuum sale in front of my wife, you know. But he threw all the dirt over the floor, and then he walked out, and he didn't scoop it up, you know? Maybe he needed a new bag. I don't know. But, uh, oh, uh, I guess that's the thing in everything. If you don't scoop it up, you don't win, huh? And you, need a, you need a new bag, probably. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, with that, I will say for him to do, but because I have a and more, lot more cars to make. Hi, Mrs. O'Connor. Mr. Brennan from the church. Yeah. How are you today? Mm -hmm. This is on a display we had at the church. Let me take a minute. Could I ask you this question? And I know what you're going to say. What part of the set do you like the best? Which part of this complete library do you like the best? Which do I like the best? Yeah. Uh, which would you consider, which would you say is the basic part of the library or what's something which would appeal to you or which you derive the most out of? I personally think the Bible. That's right. That's what most people say. Mm. Yeah. And of course... But I have one that I wouldn't part with for years, for nothing. Yeah. I've had it for years and years that yeah. uh, mm. belonged to my mother-in-law and I don't know where she got it from. I have the old, fa the old yeah, family, yeah. I bet it's over 200 years old or something. Oh, I'd say close to 100 yeah. anyway. Oh, no, by no means ever part with the Bible. I have one myself. In fact, uh, <clears throat> my husband said his mother-in-law, his mother read to him every single day out of that Bible. Yeah, well, they I say think that's something... Uh, sentimental value attached mm. to it. Well, I could see where you would choose the Bible, and I'll tell you the reason why. The Bible, that's why the Bible is the best seller in the world. Mm. Well, actually, I can't see buying another Bible when I already have one. Even though it's 200 years old. Well, you're probably tight now, is that correct? Oh, that's for sure. Yeah. So as they say, it's the only thing that I know that you secure in a lifetime that doesn't depreciate. A car after three years is worth nothing. A Bible like that will build something that will really build up a heritage in the home. It's a beautiful book. Isn't it beautiful? I know you love it. Honest to goodness, Mrs. O'Connor, 
I've been in the Bible business now. The reason I'm in it, I know that I'm placing something at home that people will never be dissatisfied. The longer they have it, the more they will enjoy it. It's like a good wine. With age, it improves. And don't worry, they don't repossess the Bible if one month you don't mail in the payment. You mail in payment the following month, that's all. About nine o'clock, you walking down the road standing. I don't know, some little better than I'm here to walk down. All right, Maureen, you've been on that phone long enough. And if you didn't like it, Mrs. O'Connor, I wouldn't spend the time, but most of the people that I do place are with the Irish people because they're the very devout Catholics, you know that. Oh, man, that Irish. Well, it doesn't make any difference. Are you not Irish descent? No. What descent are you doing? Polish. Polish? Well, the Polish are good people. Oh, yes. I know a lot of good well, Polish people. They're very devout Catholics, too. It doesn't make any difference, but the Irish I happen to place an awful lot with because I'm of Irish, you know, heritage myself. But I, uh, as I said before, don't don't think I, in Worcester, I had quite a, all the Polish section there. Believe you me, we place more Bibles than you can shake a stick at. Well, everything in this life is a sacrifice. Oh, that's for sure. right? How about six months from now? Who knows what six months is going to bring? Well, nobody knows what the next day is going to come. You know, there's... That's why I don't... Uh, uh, I don't want to take the chance and commit myself. Well, it wouldn't be too much of a chance. It involves forty-nine ninety-five for the Bible, Mrs. O'Connor. Uh, and that's not much... You know what I mean? A carton of cigarettes a week costs you $3. Does Dad have a birthday coming up? I'm sorry, not at this particular time. Do you want to reserve it for any later day? Because well, I don't know what's going to... Well, nobody knows. It's the only thing we're sure of is death and taxes. Right. No, I don't think I'd better commit myself. Mm -hmm. I honestly can't see my way clear to it right now. How about in, in three, six, nine, or 12 months, you still couldn't see your way clear? Huh? Well, it could be. I don't think I'd better take it at this time. Mm. Well, I don't think there's any more I can add to it, Mrs. O'Connor. I imagine you make a lot of decisions this life. I know my wife. Oh, does. yes. You have to. You have to. That's for sure. Yeah, that's for sure. But, like anything else, I think this would be a wise decision. But, that's your, you know. Decision. Circumstances were different, I'd say yes. I wouldn't hesitate because it is a beautiful piece of art. Yeah. Well, uh, I mean, actually, is it the dollar week that's on your I mean, I don't understand. Really, honest to God, I've been selling Bibles for 10 years. I don't understand a dollar a week. No, it doesn't sound like a much, but uh, there's other things that I've got to take care of first before I can start putting out another 4 or $5 a week. A month? A month, rather. Oh, there's two other, too many other ones. Mm. That I've got to pay up first. Okay, then. Okay. I'll visit your phone on the door, Mr. O'Connor. Thanks again. Thank you for your time. That's all right. That's my job.